Did you take off early today? Because you're just in time for Family Feud. I'm Lucky McCoy, and I'm in the mood for a feud. What say we meet today's feud and families? They've got their feuding faces on. The King family is ready to throw down and win all the money. You want to know how to play the feud? It's very simple. We've surveyed 100 people, and you need to guess the answers they've come up with to our questions. The team that does the best goes on to play fast money and has the chance to win 20,000 bucks. Okay, folks, here we go. We're gonna start with the face-off. I'm gonna need one person from both families to join me up here. There's six answers up there. When you have an answer to our survey, buzz in as fast as you can. Whoever finds the top answer first gets to decide if they want to play or pass. We asked 100 people to give us an answer to this. Name something a new couple aren't used to sharing. You're in first. Okay, then. Let's check the board. Not in this survey. What do you think? Name something a new couple aren't used to sharing. Yeah. Got it. Let's run with it. Friends. Oh, it's not there. We can do better than that, right? Name something a new couple aren't used to sharing. Okie dokie. Let's see it. Bedroom. That's at the tippy top of the board. Now here's the million dollar question. Play or pass? Rejoin your family and let's get started. All right, let's hear it. Okay. Is it up there? Show me. Bathroom. Oh, yeah. Yes. You look like someone who's got a good guess for us. That's your answer. Let's see if the board's got it. Car. Don't. Strike one. Two more and you're out. Oops. What's your answer? Uh... That's, That's, good. Answer. That's good. Our survey says... Bills. We're in the points. Name something a new couple aren't used to sharing.
I see where you're going with this. Will that be one of the missing answers? Clothes. Ouch, another strike. Got a guess ready? Because I'm gonna need one. then let's see if it's up there time and that's your third strike this round is getting thrown over to the other side one answer will do it and they can steal the round you could steal all the points with this answer That's what you're going with? Let's see if it's there. Pet! You didn't find what we wanted. You win this round. Are you ready to see the rest of the answers? What was hiding behind six? Past! Number five, what are you? House. Number four. Toothpaste. Which family is leading the way? Let's find out. We've still got plenty of game to go. Nowhere near as painful as it sounds, it's the face-off. Okay, I need someone from each family to join me up front. We have four to find on this one. Fingers on buzzers, here we go. 100 people, we asked them the following. Name something families use only when special guests visit. You're up! Yeah. Yes. Good, okay. Our survey said... Dining room. Zilch. Think you can do better? Give me what you got. Name something families use only when special guests visit. That's a good answer. It's worth a shot. The survey says, table linen. We found an answer. You want to play or do you want to pass and force them to play? That top answer is still out there. Let's see if the rest of the team can find it. I need an answer. Um, oh, Good answer. Yeah. That's what you think, huh? Is that one of the ones we're still looking for? China. Number one. I'm gonna need a guess from you. Uh, yeah, yeah. Yes. Said with confidence. Let's take a look. Guest room. You're doing great. All good. Just one answer left. Uh, oh, That's nice. answer. Yes. Is that answer good enough? Silverware. Oh, and that, yeah. my friends, is how you clear the board. Wow. Congratulations. Shall we take a look at the scores? 
One of our families is forging ahead, but there's still time to catch up. Are you ready for a face-off? One person from each team, come down and join me here at the front. You'll need seven answers. All right, let's sweeten the pot a bit. All the point values for this question have been doubled. We asked 100 people this question. What is the first thing you would do after your partner proposes to you? You're first. Good answer. Okay, sure. Did any of our 100 people say it? Tell people. You're on the board. But that top answer is still out there. Got an answer for me? What is the first thing you would do after your partner proposes to you? Oh, yeah. Answer accepted. Do we have a right answer? Accept! Still not top, but that's a better answer. The decision is yours. Will you play or pass? They're passing. It's your play now. I'm gonna need your guess. Uh-huh. Oh, yeah. Understood. Could it be there? Kiss. We've got a right answer, but it's not at the top. Nice. Yes. Think you've got a good answer? Let's hear it. Right. Good That's, a good answer. That's a repeat. <laughs> Nobody said that one. <laughs> what is the first thing you would do after your okay. partner proposes to you? We have an answer. Our survey said, cry. We found the most popular answer. Woo! Have you got some feud for thought? So... Ah, yes. There aren't many answers left. Is it there? Scream! Good work! Aha! Uh -huh. Nice! Moving along the feud chain. Uh. All right, let's try it. Is it there? Show off! Uh-oh, two strikes. Our other family better get ready. Get another strike, and the other family will get a chance.
All right. Is it up there? I got bad news, folks. That's three strikes. The other Ooh, family gets a chance to steal. It takes just one answer to steal and take home the points. What is the first thing you would do after your partner proposes to you? Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. Yep. Do we have it? Faint. That's what we were looking for. Oh, yeah. And you won another one. Let's take a look at that one remaining answer. I can't even think what it could be. And the seventh answer? Smile! What are those scores doing? That lead's looking solid now. Time to go head-to-head. -head. It's the face-off. I want two contestants to come and play. We want the magic number, seven answers. All right, now, it's still anyone's game because for this question, the point values are tripled. We took a survey, 100 people. Who is your favorite former first lady? In like a flash, what do you think? Yes. Got it. And our survey says, Michelle Obama. It's up there, but it's not the top answer. Can you find the top answer? It's still up there. Who is your favorite former first lady? Interesting answer. Let's see if that's a good answer. Jackie Kennedy. That, my friend, is the top answer. So what are you going to do here? Play or pass? Oh, still feeling confident after that last round? I like that. Let's play. And now it's your guess. Yeah? Good yeah, answer. Nice. Good answer. Here we go, then. Survey said... Martha Jefferson! Uh, oh. You failed to find an answer, which means you get your first strike of the round. Uh. I bet you've got a great answer for us. Feeling lucky? And what did our survey say? Nancy Reagan. That'll do. Woo. Yeah. Get your feuding face on. It's your go. Oh. Good. That's good. Yeah. Sure thing. Show me that answer. Laura Bush. <laughs> You've got another strike on the board. Uh-oh. Remember, if you don't get this one, the other family has a chance to steal. Good answer. Nice. I want to see that answer. Barbara Bush. You're still in the game. Oh, yeah. Oh, nice. Who is your favorite former first lady? Huh? Yes. 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 Okay. Did our survey agree? Hannah Van Buren. <laughs> Dang, that's three strikes. Sorry, folks. The other team is in with a chance. If you want to steal this round, you need to find me a missing answer. Find a good answer, and you'll get all the points. Oh, yeah.
Are you sure about that? Let's see if that's a correct answer. Hillary Clinton. That's what we want. Our winning family. Let's see those missing answers. What's behind number seven? Martha Washington. Show me number five. Eleanor Roosevelt. It's time to find out who's won the game. And that's it. We have ourselves a winner. Well done, folks. Now you're playing fast money. Looks like we'll have to say goodbye to the Kings. And I hate goodbyes. Time to cash in quick. It's fast money. I need two people. As team captain, you get to choose who'll be joining you to play fast money. Let's kick this pig and play the feud. You're up first. You'll get five questions, and you'll give me the most popular answers for them in order to score the biggest amount of points. If you and your buddy can get 200 points or more, you'll take home the big bucks. Your time starts now. Name something that couples fight over the use of. Name something you do when your spouse won't stop snoring. What monster scares you the most? Name a type of pain in your life that you want a quick relief from. Name a sport in which you might fall off something. That's it. Now for the second contestant. Think you can do better? You need to try and find the best answers to the surveys. If you repeat anything that's already been said, you'll have to guess again. Okay, start the clock. Name something that couples fight over the use of. Name something you do when your spouse won't stop snoring. What monster scares you the most? Name a type of pain in your life that you want a quick relief from. Name a sport in which you might fall off something. All right, that's all five of them. Okay, you've done all you can. Let's bring both of our players out here and see how they did. For our first question, we asked, name something that couples fight over the use of. So you said, I think we might be good on this one. Nice work, that's a top answer. For question two, we asked, name something you do when your spouse won't stop snoring. Let's remind everyone what you said. Those look like some mighty fine answers. 
the number one answer. For the next question, we asked, what monster scares you the most? The answers you gave. Both of these answers are looking strong. A good answer and a not so good answer. Wondering about that top answer? Vampire. We asked you, name a type of pain in your life that you want a quick relief from. Here are your answers. And our survey said, you've done it. You've earned yourself an impressive victory. Just briefly, let's see what the remaining answers were. You get 20,000 smackers to take home with you. Now don't spend it all in one place. This is Lucky McCoy thanking you oh so much for playing. See you next time.